Kim, I can imagine this has just been so research intensive for you and you've spent, I can imagine, months of your, your time mm. working on it. Do you walk away from having conducted this type of research feeling optimistic about reconciliation in South Africa? Does it worry you? Just from a researcher's perspective. Yeah, so for me, um, where we're going in South Africa, I hope, is towards greater honesty and greater acknowledgement of the issues that we face. As a researcher, I've done a lot of history um, research on history and the nature of the transition. And these contradictions that feel so of now and of this moment actually have a long legacy in the way that things get set up. So it is, it's optimistic in the sense that there's deeper acknowledgement of the issues. And I'm a firm believer that we cannot hope to progress in the future unless we are able to be honest about what are the issues and how are we going to address them with care. Um, so it's a, it's a mixed bag and it's, you know, the ability to hold the complexity of what are the difficult findings, but how do those actually help us the most in terms of creating a better future? Mm.